Welcome back to Daytime Now Art Now. Uh, we're joined by uh, Peter Sukson Chan. He is a professional Chinese watercolor painting and a Western oil painting expert. We'll call you an expert, Peter. Okay? Thank Just you. Like Thank that, you. Right? <laughs> so you've been in, uh, in living in Mississauga for over 20 years now yes. and infusing your tradition into our uh, painting culture, let's say, right? Yes, yes. Welcome to the show. Well, thank you for having me. I always enjoy watching your show. It's great. Oh, oh I appreciate thank you that. Very thank you very much. So why don't we talk a little bit about how you started off painting in the first place? Well, sure. Uh, actually, when I was small, I already loved to paint. I, uh, I remember all my babysitter told me that, oh, you are a good kid. Just give you some paper and a pencil. Then that's it. You will sit there for hours. Yeah. The yes. And painting. yes. So this is something that, you, uh, that has stuck with you then throughout your entire life? Yes, yes. And were they impressed when you were drawing things as a little child and then they, they came back later and said, oh my gosh, that's, he actually has quite a talent. <laughs> yes, you're yeah, right. I don't know whether they true or not. They told, oh, he will be an artist one day in the future when he grow up. <laughs> yeah. right, and there you though. go. Look at you now. Now you're on daytime discussing your art. So yeah. that's pretty awesome. You know, so Chinese watercolor, let's, let's, let's talk a little bit about that for those of us who are not too familiar with yes. it. What is it exactly? Um, Chinese watercolor painting. Um, it's very abstract. Okay. And then they more emphasize uh, less is more. Okay. And is it is that uh, less is more in terms of the actual uh, darkness to the uh, colors? Yes, or? yes. And then, but I use two different uh, style. I use the traditional detailed Chinese painting that is more similar to the Western oil painting. They're more concentrated on uh, detail and tech lit okay. and usually take you like more than 20, 30 hours to finish one painting. Oh my goodness, that's how, a long time. How long, sorry? 20 to 30 hours. Yeah. Wow. But you also paint things like uh, nature flowers, for example, and things like that as oh, well. Oh yes, I love nature. Yeah, we actually have some pictures nature we're going awesome. to show of some of your sure. Yeah, we have uh, some of your artwork up to show uh, the viewers at home. For those of you who have yet to see uh, Peter's work. Oh, there we go. That's a beautiful one. How long did that take you? Well, all to that, that one took me more than 30 hours. Oh 30 hours? How goodness. come it takes so long, Peter? Is it just the detail in it? Is it the, the materials because um, it is a watercolor? Uh, you're right, though, because uh, it's the detail, because you have to paint it many, many times in order right. to get that color, that effect. Right. And then uh, they very concentrate on fine details. Okay. So it takes lots of time. But I really enjoy every moment, every there minute. There you go. That's it's it's more than matters. just work. It's passion. Yes. Is it, are these uh, water uh, paint, watercolor paintings or are they oil paintings? It's watercolor painting. Oh, okay. These okay. are watercolor yes. paintings. Awesome. Okay. And is, are flowers one of your favorite things to paint? Yes. Flowers and birds and fish and oh, landscape. There's the birds. Yes. That one's really nice. I like yes, that one a yes. lot. Oh, are those cherry blossoms? Yes, yeah. yes. I love cherry blossoms. That's something I miss from Vancouver. They're everywhere there. Yeah, <laughs> with the blossoms. Oh, look at that gorgeous one. Yes, this one have a special meaning for Chinese. What does that what mean? Does it mean? Uh, the, for pine trees, that symbolize a long life, a long and a strong life. life, and that two bird also sim symbol long life. Right, life. right, right. So usually people would give it to a. Uh, older gentleman or lady to wish them to live forever. Along, that's oh, an awesome. Yeah. I love yes. that. You need to I, give me one of those. Peter, where's my pine tree, man? <laughs> I would have appreciated a pine tree. Is that right kind of like a bamboo? <laughs> yeah, there you go, right? It's, it's kind of like a bamboo tree too, right? Like yes, same yes. Same type of deal, yes. wish luck. Well, so here's some peacocks. peacocks. Yes, peacock. One of my favorite birds. What, mm. is, do peacocks have any meaning? or is this Oh, yes, oh, yes. Yeah, what In Chinese tradition, peacock, they always symbolize a wealthy life, wealthy life. and abundance of wealth. Yes, and then the purpose of this uh, painting, I want to uh, show people the, the beauty of life and the nature. Right, that one's really nice as well, that uh, oh, yeah. uh, kind of a rose type Yeah, of that flower. is an oil painting I did. Beautiful. Okay. Good oh. job. You got a lot of talent, Peter. So uh, Thank you. a lot of your paintings uh, symbolize uh, po positiveness, right? Something yes. very strong positive. Yes, you're right. Um, all my paintings carry a message of peace, love, and and well-being, yeah, and kindness, yes. definitely. So where do you get this inspiration for all of this to, to paint? I feel from the nature, Canada is beautiful. This is why I come <laughs> to live in Canada everywhere. When you look outside, it's beautiful. It is a beautiful mm -hmm. country, yes. yeah. Uh, but I mean, um, well, in the city now, I mean, it's, it's, it's all buildings now. We write a, a lot of great, beautiful architecture going on in the city. So do you ever go um, maybe outside into like the countryside to check out, get some inspiration Oh, as yes, well? yes. Yeah. I always went away for trips and to get idea to enjoy the, the, the environment. Yes. Right. You can go to North Brampton. 
uh, just before like Mayfield and get as much as uh, the country before the city gets oh, there. Oh, thank so you for it's, letting it's, me it's know. Yeah. It's expanding. Yeah, it's a lot, really beautiful up on the Kalendon uh, border as well, right? You can get some yes, good yes. inspiration there. So uh, how do people recognize your uh, your work? Do they, do they love it? Is it something they want to add to their home as well? I was very f lucky that uh, many people, they did collect my painting from USA and Hong Kong and people in here too. Right. So it was very encouraging, very happy to... To, mm -hmm. to get that kind of response, yeah. So let's awesome. talk a little bit about how you have a, a grand opening coming up. You That's exciting. It's very exciting. Yes. Are you going to be displaying the similar pieces that we just saw on the screen? Um, in my s exhibition, yeah. I will have more than about uh, 40 paintings. Wow. So you, people will have more chances to see all my different paintings. Right, right. Wow. Oh, that's wow. awesome. And uh, how many different paintings are you going to have? Will you be painting on site as well? Um, no, I won't be because all my painting is uh, more like detail. It will take like 20, 30 hours. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So, oh, that's true. That's yes, why you, so I, people I, will maybe will get boring. Unless people just want to stay <laughs> <laughs> 30 yes. hours for a full day's worth of watching Peter paint. That'd be yes. an exciting day, right? So uh, They're welcome, though. <laughs> yeah, thank you. And uh, are people uh, able to purchase uh, the paintings while they're there or is it just something to look at kind of uh, thing? They, they can. We'll, we'll um, welcome them if they're interested in the painting, yes. Right. Okay. Is there a message you want to get out to everyone in the Peel region, maybe about your art and the exhibit coming up? Sure. Well, I am very happy to be able to live in the region of Peel. It's a great place to live. And I'd like to invite all of you to come to see my exhibition. And I wish you all uh, good health, good happiness. Thank you so much. Peter, that's right. awesome. That's You're a so good great. man. Yeah. You're very Thank positive. you. So, Thank uh, you. If everybody wants their dose of uh, positivity in their life, you know, some wellness and all that, take a look at Peter's artwork. And that's going on October 30th uh, on a Saturday at well, 12.45 noon. That's when the uh, grand opening yes. takes place. Uh, mm -hmm. We appreciate you for coming on the show and uh, showcasing your talent on our show. And being so inspirational. Yes, very inspirational. Thank you, thank you. And, yeah. and, and very proud of you uh, to be a part of the city of Mississauga. Thank so you. thank you for being here. All your information will be up on the board for uh, Peter's grand opening. Probably give Brittany some tips. I need some. <laughs> Stay tuned. We'll be right back.